Hi everyone, in this video I'll be discussing about Ventoy. Ventoy is a free and open source program that allows you to write image files such as ISOs onto storage media, such as flash drives to create bootable USB flash drives. If you don't have a flash drive, you can use any type of media such as SD cards and external drives as well and make them bootable. With all these image files on it, the utility acts like an aggregator and will allow you to boot from any of them. So this is what it will look like when you boot from it. It will provide a list of them, the ISO files that you have, and you can select which one that you want to boot. It's very convenient to store all your ISOs on a single USB flash drive instead of formatting the flash drive over and over each time. So this will save you lots of time. So downloading and installing is very quick and simple. So I'll go and download it. Go to Google. Download Ventoy, and this is the Windows version. I'm going to open it up, and here it is. And if I want to check the hash for it, so I can open up Command Prompt. I'll go to the directory and I can use the cert util command hash file then toy and this is SHA-256 and it'll give me the hash for it and I can compare so it's going to be the last one here and I can compare with it and make sure it's consistent I'm going to go back to my downloads folder and here's the file and I'll extract all, extract it here. Now I'm going to put in a USB drive. Okay, and so it's here, the, it's the E drive and now I'm going to do Ventoy to disk. And I'm going to send it to the E drive. And so I'm going to install Ventoy on it. So install. The device will be formatted on data will be lost. Continue. Yes. And double checking. Yes. OK, congratulations. Ventoy has been successfully installed to the device. Hit OK. I'm going to close this. OK, and if I go to the E drive, and so this is where I'm going to put my ISO files. And if you go into disk management, and you'll see here the E drive, and then there's another partition here where it keeps all the Ventoy files. So I'm going to close this, and I'm going to put some ISOs on here. And so I'm going to put Clonezilla, Gparted, Linux Mint, and Windows 10 on it. So I'm going to copy these over. Okay, so they've been copied over, the ISO files. So I'm just going to restart my system here and then I'm going to boot from the USB drive. Okay, and this is what shows up. So the Ventoy screen and then there's the ISO files. So if I want to boot up Clonezilla, okay, I'm booting in normal mode. Okay, it boots up Clonezilla, and so I'm just going to restart it, and I'm going to boot up Linux Mint. Okay, I'm going to boot up Linux Mint here, boot in normal mode. Okay, it's booted up into Linux Mint here, live CD, so everything is good here. I'm just going to restart, and then I'm going to boot into the Windows 10 ISO. Okay, and selecting Windows 10, boot in normal mode. Okay, so it's booted up into the Windows ISO file here, and I have the Windows setup here, and it's asking me to do an install, so it's able to boot it up, no problems here. 
So that's it. That's Ventoy. It's very quick and simple to install and use. I recommend it and it will save you lots of time instead of formatting your disk over and over. I hope you find this video useful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.